After LBJ, we were uh, red all the way, um, and Ann Richards was uh, a phenomenon. And she united so many different people. She um, brought in um, not only Republicans and Democrats into her office, she had um, blacks, Latinos, Asians, um, gays, straight. People say that when you met her, she made you feel like you were the only person in the room, that she took that time to connect with each and every person. And that's special. Her actions in the governor's office reflected that she remembered what she talked to the everyday man about. Ann Richards had grit and she was funny and tough. You want to meet Linda? <laughs> Ann Richards uh, was a strong woman. She had a huge heart. And I get a little verklempt. It, it, her, you know, her focus was always on others. In my opinion, um, this show reflects uh, the most honor that there can be in a, in a political position. And what we say in the play is that the government is the most pervasive institution in our lives. And if we don't participate, then we're just letting other people make a lot of decisions for us. Ann Richards, she represented us. Mm -hmm. She believed in government and all the good that it could be. And uh, we need a little bit more of that in our politics today. If she were around today, I think she would have a lot to say about our current a elections. A lot of things. <laughs> <laughs> a lot of things. And also, it's awfully funny. <laughs> I, I've been told I need to be funny as hell. Because <laughs> it's, it's on the posters, right? So I'm working. Tough as nails, <laughs> funny as hell. Yeah, that's right. So that's what I have to be. So hopefully they'll come and laugh, mm -hmm. get a little sentimental, and, and get a, a little bit more patriotic in the lives. It's witty, <laughs> funny, and it's a great two hours to spend with uh, with Anne here. That's right. <laughs>